My name is Cassandra Cowdery. I go by Cassie. I'm a teacher within the Berkeley County School District and I teach music at Berkeley Intermediate School. The accomplishments that I'm most proud of this year are always the successes of my students. I've been able to watch the confidence of my students grow over the last three years to such a high level. Many of my students tried out this year for the Berkeley County STEP program, which can be a very anxiety filled experience. They have to go in with a prepared piece, either singing or playing an instrument, and they're also gonna be creating on the spot. Instead of giving up, my students accepted the challenge and succeeded. Many have been able to join the program and grow their passion for music. It makes me so proud to watch the students grow musically and push themselves outside of their own comfort zone. This year, I've seen the students at VIS become more comfortable with performing and creating than years past, which really warms my heart. They've been really in charge of their own learning. Something innovative I have tried this year is while we were still within the school building, I wrote and won a grant through the Berkeley Electric Bright Ideas grant program. With this money, I was able to purchase African drums from my classroom. We as a class have been able to play these drums and participate in many rhythm activities while using them as a communication tool. My third, fourth, and fifth graders have absolutely loved it. This has really helped build a classroom environment that is very positive. Ever since we have moved to remote teaching, I've tried to continue with our prior drum experience by using cup drums. The students loved it and I felt like it was a step in the right direction. It felt silly at times definitely playing cups instead of drums, but the kids loved it and kept going. Since then, I've been holding weekly Google Meets with my classes and chorus. We have created our own instruments, made melodies with water glasses, and the students have learned a couple of folk dances through Google Meet. Soon they'll be creating banjos. This year, has definitely been a year where I have had a, to embrace a growth mindset. First, I was moved to teach at two schools this year instead of just one. My home school is Berkeley Intermediate School, but when I walked into this school year, I was told I was also gonna be teaching at Weissville Elementary School. So I teach at Berkeley Intermediate four days and Weissville one day. While learning a new community of kids and staff, at one school, I had to keep teaching my passion, which is music. I had to think of different ways to meet a new set of students once I finally felt comfortable with my feet flat on the ground, that's when we moved to remote learning. It was a battle to keep a growth mindset, but I had to make changes on how I would teach my lessons and make learning fun through technology. Once I was asked to start giving Google Meets by my principal, I jumped right in and embraced the challenge. I was so excited. If I had to, I knew it would be okay to fail forward. This was new to everybody, but nothing mattered more to me than the students joining on the video, smiling and having fun. Last, I would like to share that teaching music is 100% my passion. I miss going into the school building every single day and teaching. Once you find your passion, the journey has begun. You will always have bumps in the road, but make sure you embrace them. Change is not always a bad thing, and it has led me to learn brand new ideas of how to meet the needs of my students in a different way and how I can help my students find their own passion.